Africa and we are here in Genesis Mall in Victoria Island, Lagos to witness the premiere of Mecca, the Pretty Serpent. Now, Nollywood has done so well in recent times with remakes and we do hope that this one is no different. My name is Amanda Dara and you're watching East Flash on TVC. Keep it locked for the fun and the extravagant moments on the black carpet tonight. I'm here to support my dear friend Idia in her first big role in a movie and I'm so proud of her. I can't wait to see what she does with the world. I saw the trailer and I was like, my jaw was on the floor. I was like, it looks so good. I'm just really excited to see what she does and I'm, I know it's going to be a good movie. I mean, I already know. It was a really big movie back then. I watched it as a child. I loved it. And so taking it on is... I mean, it's, it's going to be interesting to see what they do with it because it's super big. I mean, they've done something with Living in Bondage and they did so well, so I, I'm, I'm sure it's in good hands and I'm looking forward to what they do. It's been 28 years between the first installment and this new one and um, I'm pretty much excited and I'm keeping an open mind as to what to expect tonight. I'm expecting amazing visual, storytelling, amazing plots and super amazing uh, performances too, so it's like a triple threat of amazing. I haven't watched it yet. Um, I'm expecting it to live up to the original. Because if it doesn't, then I mean, it's still, but yeah, fingers crossed that it does live up to the original. Yeah. Growing up, I, I saw this film, right, and it was one of those, or it is one of those um, classics, right, and having to come here and watch the remake. And not only just watch it and be a part of it, because I actually play the father to Neka in this film. It's such an elating feeling. It's very nostalgic for me. I mean, it's a movie we all grew up um, on. And it's interesting for me to see what they have done. I'm very much interested to see what they have done with the story. Because, you know, with Living in Bondage, you know, they blew the story out of the water. So I'm excited to see what's going to be, you know, the plot twist in this one. I can't wait. Oh, I actually love the cast, you understand? It's a blend of the new, the old, the contemporary, and you know, you get people like Beverly Naya, you get Idia, who is actually a new actor, and then you get Shafi, you have Zakoji, so it cuts across all, um, all parts of the industry, and then a lot of people are going to be part of it, so it's nice. I think that there's a little bit in this movie for everyone, a lot of action, a lot of comedy, and a lot of emotion, um, love, and I think that they'll definitely enjoy enjoy this one. And it's going to be amazing. I cannot wait to watch the beautiful masterpiece that is going to be having I mean, Istosinigo. Intrigue, suspense, fun, something new, because that's all we do. We bring new things to your faces. They killed my parents. I think watching the movie, it's it's more interesting than even being like acting it. Because watching it, you get to see everything and how everything got to play out. So the movie is really, really good. Really good. More than what we actually expected. I was thinking it was going to be quite a horror film, but I'll be very honest, it wasn't really scary. I think it would fit into more of... Um, it was wonderful, all in general. The lead actress, she gave a very wonderful performance, you know, everything was top notch. It's not every time you get to enjoy Nigerian movies like this. This was one in town, spectacular, amazing job. So please don't miss out, come and watch my baby girl and my daughter in the movie, Neka, as we show you our special audience. TVC.